Hey guys, Hank Hoffmeyer here. I thought I'd do a quick video on how I uh, use uh, the app Word Swag to create some inspirational images. And I believe it's $4.99 in the App Store. And it'll help you create some great images to share on social media, such as Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. So I'm going to go ahead and launch the Word Swag app. So from here I have some options. I can go ahead and take a picture if I uh, feel like I need to take one right then and there. Or I can use pictures I have stored on my iPhone. Or there are um, some offerings as far as stock photos for free that's included in the price, which is pretty awesome. So let's go ahead and click on the two pictures. And let's search for ocean. So what's gonna happen here is we're gonna look for images that have an ocean. And there's one with a shell. Um, there's one with um, some mountains and uh, you know some cliffs. So let's go ahead and choose that one. So now we have the option to crop or not crop. I'm going to use the not crop option. And then the options come up to go ahead and create your text. It defaults to the uh, first style type. And uh, uh, you'll see uh, the little box areas that give you the Twitter preview area. So most times you want to try to keep your text in between those areas. So uh, let's go in here and type in happy day. And save and close, or we can uh, go ahead and choose built in um, quotes, etc., and put those in there, and it'll all automatically give credit to whoever has created those quotes. Um, you can do breaks and lines, in other words, it'll do carriage return when it needs to if it's longer. But just for the sake of this demo, let's go ahead and save and close this, and you'll notice that my text is up there, and I can go ahead and sort through some of these different styles here and I can choose different options for different styles as well as different styles altogether. So we could do this one here. Uh, we can jump over to Disco, Frisco Disco here and choose one. So let's go with this. But look, it looks like it's getting a little washed out. I can change the color to blue, black, whatever I want to. But I can also change the brightness for the image and make it darker. And I can also blur the background a little bit if I want to. Let's just do a tiny bit of a blur. There we go. And we can choose colors for the text. We can invert it. Um, there's actually um, some different options here. So let's choose that one so it looks a little washed out. Then when I click Done, I have the ability to go ahead and just save it to my camera roll. I can share it right out to my social media profiles here. I can add a watermark or a logo, which I'm going to go ahead and add my signature. And I'm going to go down to logos and choose my signature and put my signature down at the bottom. And I can make that transparent or not, but I'm going to keep it that way. And go ahead and share that. And there it is. So if I go out to my images, that image will be there. There you go.